Hardly many people have heard about Brunei. Brunei, a tiny island nation with abundant oil and gas reserves, has one of the highest living standards in the world. And it is led by Sultan Hassan al Bolkiah of Malay Monarchy, who comes in the list of 10 richest royals in the world by SCMP. Did you know that the Sultan has a collection of 5,000 cars and a palace which is made of gold? Or that Sultan spent 19,000 pounds on a single haircut? Probably not. So in today's video, we'll reveal the inside and lavish life of the Brunei royal family and how this small nation's royal family has a billion dollar fortune. Before we go a little further, let's talk about how this royal family came to power. The royal family of Brunei may be traced back to the 14th century, 1368 to be exact. Brunei's early history is obscure, and exact facts have been lost to time since official records began some hundred years later. What we do know is that Muhammad Shah was the country's first sultan. Brunei grew into an empire, and then lost most of it to colonial forces, giving birth to a 600-year-old Malay monarchy. Brunei fell into decline at the end of the 17th century because of the Brunei Civil War, piracy, and European colonial expansion. In the same century, Brunei lost Manila in the brief battle with Spain. The empire lost much of its territory with the arrival of Western powers. Brunei's collapse was accelerated in the 19th century when it relinquished much of its territory to the White Rajas of Sarawak, resulting in the country's current limited size and division into two halves. In 1888, Sultan Hashim Jalalil Alam Akamadin petitioned the British to stop additional annexation. After that, Brunei has been a British protectorate from 1888 to 1984. In 1984, the country finally gained full independence. When it obtained independence, it immediately flourished due to the discovery of oil. Currently, the country is led by Sultan of Brunei Hassanal Bolkia, who is crowned in August 1968. He is also the country's finance minister and minister of defense. He is among the world's wealthiest rulers, with a personal fortune estimated at $27.7 billion. Now let's take a brief look at the family's royal lifestyle. The palace owned by the royal family. The Sultan of Brunei lives in the world's largest royal home, the Istana Nural Iman Palace, which cost around $600 million, according to insider reports. The palace is located at Brunei River's Bank. According to the report, the palace in which Sultan Hassan al Bolkiah lives is made up of gold. The palace was built in 1984, and it spread over an area of 2 million square feet. The dome of the palace is studded with 22 karat gold. The palace contains 1,788 premises. The whole palace contains 200,000 square meters of space. The mosque of the palace can accommodate up to 1,500 people, while the banquet hall can provide space for over 5,000 guests. The palace even has a helipad, five swimming pools, and more than 250 bathrooms. Apart from 110 garages, there are air-conditioned stables for 200 horses. The palace was named as the world's largest residential palace by Guinness World Records. Other properties owned by the royal family. Prince Jeffrey Bolkia, his younger brother, lives in luxurious Regent's Park at St. John's Lodge. It is estimated to be worth $203 million, making it the most expensive private property in the UK. Car collection owned by the royal family. The car collection of Sultan of Brunei is considered to be the largest private car collection in the world. He has approximately 7,000 cars, which have an estimated combined value of 5 billion US dollars. Within his collection of cars, the Sultan has McLaren F1s, Ferrari F40s, and Rolls Royces. The collection has a high value, particularly because of the rarity of the vehicles and their value. And many of the Sultan's cars are customized and covered in real gold. Yacht owned by the royal family. According to our reports, Sultan of Brunei currently does not own any yacht. However, the biggest yacht in the world, named as Dubai, was commissioned by the Sultan of Brunei's brother, Prince Jeffrey Bolkia, in 1996. But due to some internal family issues, it was sold to another royal family. The Dubai royal family currently own the yacht. The estimated value of the yacht is around 400 million US dollars. Jets owned by the royal family. According to a report by BornRich.com, Hassan al-Bokia has several private jets equipped with luxury facilities. A 
A customized Boeing 747 with a golden crystal decorated living room and bedroom is part of the Sultan's private aviation fleet. Solid gold wash basins may also be found in the plane's toilet, which costs 233 million pounds. Finally, he also has a 75 million pound custom Airbus and a 136 million pound Boeing 767. Friends and family aren't the only ones who benefit from the luxury plane. He also flew his hairdresser in for a single haircut, which costs around 19,000 pounds. Other expenses by the royal family. The Sultan has 12 offspring. When his oldest son and heir, Crown Prince al Mati Billah, married in 2004, Whitney Houston was paid $10.1 million to sing at the reception. And the bride received a bouquet which was made of pure gold and studded with diamonds. Even the bride's shoes were adorned with precious stones. She also wears an anklet made of pure gold. The princess wore a ruby studded crown on her head, the most valuable gemstone of which is the size of a two euro coin. Her magnificent necklace is also adorned with numerous rubies and diamonds. According to several reports, the wedding's estimated cost is around 80 to 100 million dollars, which is considered to be one of the most expensive weddings in the world. Look no further than his lavish 50th birthday celebration in 1996 to get a sense of just how affluent this man is. Sultan Hassanal spent $36.9 million on two weeks of festivities for himself, which included a polo match and an elaborate gala supper featuring beluga caviar. To commemorate the event, he paid Michael Jackson $25.8 million for three shows. Until now, we have heard how royal families spend their billions, but now let's see how royal family earns this vast fortune. So let's talk about the companies owned by the royal family. One of the major companies owned by the royal family is Brunei Investment Agency, BIA. BIA include major foreign assets. Some major foreign assets of BIA include the Dorchester Collection, which is a portfolio of luxury hotels established in 1996. Dorchester Collection owns and manages nine luxury five-star hotels. The Dorchester in London, the Beverly Hills Hotel in Beverly Hills, Plaza Athena in Paris, Hotel Morris in Paris, and many more around Europe and the USA. The estimated assets of the Dorchester is more than $2 billion. BIA also has 10% holding in the Patterson Securities of Australia and the Bahagia Investment Corporation in Malaysia. The biggest company owned by royal family in terms of revenue is Brunei Shell Petroleum. Shell and the Brunei government are 50-50 shareholders in Brunei Shell Petroleum. The estimated net worth of the company is around $10 billion. Apart from this, Royal Brunei Airlines is also owned by BIA. The BIA manages assets worth around $160 billion worldwide philanthropy work. The royal family is also involved in philanthropy work. The royal family mainly manages the Sultan Haji Hassanal Bolkia Foundation. The foundation is involved in an effort to enhance the welfare, education, and well-being as well as to stimulate the social, cultural, and economic development of citizens and residents of Brunei. The foundation also gives support and provides sponsorship to non-government bodies or NGOs in implementing programs designed to encourage the needy to be self-reliant. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Share with your friends and family. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit the bell button to be notified for more videos.